life of a mega nerd, baby. We doing things and we making it happen, right? From the trash 80 to a black Mercedes, no one can stop us now, cause we're keeping it nerdy, nice. What's up YouTube, this is Chris with Sage Films and uh, in this tutorial I'll be teaching you guys how to upload your icons that you create or that you find on the internet into your Visual Basic programs. Uh, if you ha don't know how to create a icon, uh, look at my other video, Creating Icons with Adobe Fireworks S3 and that will pretty much get you started into this tutorial. So basically what we're going to do is, I've already got an icon created, it's not really the icon I want for a actual program program, but I'm just going to basically show you guys how to do it, just a really quick tutorial. Let's just go ahead and open up, and let's just create, just go right here in my terms of use program, just going to open that up. And just while it loads, just sit here, I guess. <laughs> and so here we go. Basically, just go to your design here. And just this is basically what it is. You probably, if you watch my other tutorial, you'll know what this is from. But just go ahead and go into Project and go to Terms of Use Properties or whatever the name of your program is. Properties. You'll go over here to the Application tab and go to Icon. You'll click the Down list there and click Browse. And if you've already created it, which I have one created on the desktop. I'll just kind of open that up, and you know what? I don't think I'll open this up. I'll open up one out of this folder, and these are a group of Xbox 360 uh, icons that I downloaded off the internet. You can download really any any icon that you want off the internet. These are just some I downloaded. So I'm just going to get this Xbox 360 controller and just click open, and there you go. That'll be the logo or the not really logo, but icon when you create a sh shortcut on your desktop also if you look here at your forms let's just go here form one design you can see how it has this little uh, pen and paper up here I'm also going to show you guys how to change that icon so to change that you'll just go over here to your form properties and you'll scroll up until you get to icon you just click on it click the three dots same thing just choose what you want, I'll just choose that and click open. And as you can see, it automatically changes it to the Xbox 360 controller. Uh, so, yeah, that was just a quick visual basic tutorial on how to upload icons. I uh, hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. And also, please subscribe to my second account, uh, Sage Film Tutorials. The link will be in the description because I'm having some issues with my main account right now. And if I get one more offense, for copyright infringement which I got copyright infringement for one of my tutorials I don't know why because it's my content but if I get one more my account will be suspended so if you want to see more of my videos please subscribe to my other channel and if this one gets banned I will upload all my videos to my other channel so I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial please rate, comment, and subscribe and I'll see you next time